Again, a question from a pregnant woman. Why is it important to see the dentist after giving birth? So after giving birth, that sounds like we have two people we're talking about now, but certainly for the moms, what are we saying here? Uh, now, you may think that now the baby's out of my body, I don't need to control my diet or my hygiene anymore, but uh, bacteria can still be transmitted to the baby. Uh, and uh, same thing with prevention, the knowledge of uh, simply uh, avoiding to share food with uh, the baby, uh, kissing directly right on the mouth, uh, that can transmit bacteria. Uh, and that's where that appointment, the two month appointment, is important and uh, it's mostly for mommy for for her to gain that knowledge right because there's no point in talking about it too early and because then it's not relevant to her and then she may forget and her uh, mind yes. other things so, yes. right. so at, at that point uh, that's where we, we can show mommy how to uh, clean baby's gums uh, and most mothers don't don't know that you have to do that but uh, uh, the benefit of doing uh, 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 wiping the gums is that we, we're uh, removing bacteria. That's that's the number one reason. Number two is that uh, with uh, the slight pressure, we are stimulating uh, the gums and, and uh, teething. Okay, and um, also uh, taking care of mommy's teeth is important because if uh, mommy's teeth are healthy, then there's less chance of transmitting. And plus, um, for example, if mommy wasn't um, healthy because of pain or, or whatnot, she would not be physically um, uh, fit to take care of, of her baby because it's very demanding. You're, you're, you're losing sleep, um, waking up for, for nursing and all that. Uh, and uh, for the baby, it's, it's important as well because we can detect small problems such as uh, um, tissue problems or uh, uh, like the tongue can sometimes be tied down to the floor of the mouth and it can affect uh, it well, seems to me as well that you, you, you recommend no x-rays for about a year. Is that correct for mom? Uh, well, Is that for mom, for baby? Uh, no, it's, it's for, uh, for both because obviously uh, during the pregnancy we avoid x-rays, right? Uh, now, after um, when uh, the two months appointment is a good time for x-rays because uh, now it's been over a year that mommy hasn't had x-rays. I see, okay. And uh, things can develop because of changes in the diet and the hygiene. And it's like when you're getting braces and they come off, it's a good time to come in for x-rays because little things can develop and then that's where we can detect them and fix them early because if uh, there is a cavity that develops into a, a bigger problem and then mommy is not at her best, mm. then she won't be able to take care of baby. I guess the, the short answer as well here is let's get mom back on track to where she would have been for sure, if she had yeah. just stayed right on that dental health program. Yes. Very good. Yeah, so Dr. Julie, it sounds like there is so much that you have to kind of take into consideration that it can be kind of overwhelming. So this notion of getting back on track yes. makes a lot of sense. Um, anything to add to that? Well, mommy is uh, always known to take care of herself last, mm -hmm. right? So um, and that's why we have it there. So it's a reminder for her to take care of her teeth so she can also take care of her baby. Um, when baby is born, actually, baby doesn't have any bacteria that are causing cavities in her mouth and they acquire that later on. Mm -hmm. And who's the first person that they get it from? It's mommy. Okay, so, so mom she's taking care of any bacteria she has yes. is actually about yes. preventing this, illness in her child. This so. is how our baby gets you know, the, the bacteria most of the time. So we want to make sure that our mouth is in top health as well. Because, I mean, as much as we, we tell the moms not to share the food, not to lick the spoon. It we, happens it a happens, little bit, right? It happens, <laughs> we kiss them. We, Kiss them, you know, on the lips, like close to the lips, and you know, we we do pass it on. We're, we're not so. focused on bacteria. At yes, that point, right? <laughs> <laughs> but and, and that's why it's so so important. Because mm -hmm. um, by taking care of herself, again, we're taking care of the baby long term. Well, that's the bottom line, right? Yeah. Okay.